croaked. From Deadwood Canyon, a symphony of croaks dance around the water, and by a conductor of annoyed moans. We got an amphibious croaking cockerels. Ceases clamor at once, I demand silence. And ask for none of this and refuse all of this. Always in my nethers is <laughs> some great source of nurture to clear the desire. It, 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 <laughs> Trying to replace my hate with cracking my winds for a moment of peace from the croaking. I don't leave, Alan. I'll give unto you the greatest gift I have ever given another. My science says you pass through this canyon. Perhaps something shiny. You always had this dim witted look about you, easily hit horn swoggled by a painted stone. Ha! Again, forgive my temper command. Take these frogs with you, feed them so that they will leave me in, in feathered peace, and I can begin regrowing my attitude. Let me do this. Now for help or return later. I am so tempted to click on return later, but screw it. I'm a. There's so for you yet, Stonehead. Come, fetch this frog near Miss My Nethers. They're the most boisterous of them all, clearly the vocal soprano of the group. Shrill like the buzzing wings of a mosquito. It's clear that mosquitoes is what this frog here is for. This process is called logic, Stonehead. Mosquitoes have all flown to the plateau, surely to escape the wretched noise. My limbs, what gift for a set of wings to fly away with right now. Now go, satiate this vocally ranged ribbiter, and then return for another frog when that one's putrid belly is full. Now, go! Okay, I see. I thought for a second that... Staff and stone wand. Yep. The bee popper. Kevin. Show the lights. He got on Kevin. What? He ate the entire- Alright, uh... That's... 
I am genuinely surprised that that little rabbit can eat that giant snail. Well, that went as well as it could have. Feed Kevin 25 snails. I don't need to like give him a lot, aren't I, huh? Oh, hey, treasure's available on the gate. Kevin's still with me. Have you guys met Kevin yet? And a mega chest. Okay, I've completely. I, I think it's all right. My eyes aren't stupid. Yep. Take an entire day now. An either staff, bashing shield, ice room, bashing shield plus five. What on earth? Holy... And yeah, there's that. But holy moly, that's... quite a lot. Reroll. So that's what's probably ever going to happen. I'm going to try a new thing. Let's see how well I do now. Mushroom Forest. Let's help Kevin to some food. Personally, that is god awful. Ashing Shield is not that good at all. I'm just straight up scrapping for things instead.
Now I want to try the four star now. Let's see how well I can survive here. Kevin, the utterly, completely deranged son of a gun. Like, holy crap. I cannot believe that little fucking eat those snails. Imagine the last one eats demons, man. Feed Kevin. One more snail just for Kevin. And Kevin's sated. See you later, Kevin. Chance of life steal. Break apart items. I do not need this. Break minus O. Oh. So it costs key? That's annoying. Rid this existence of the frog known as Kevin. Well done. <laughs> of course, I'm gonna forget you. Band leader. Keeping tempo for the others like a true maestro of mayhem. <laughs> This tree is so dramatic. But whatever. Yeah. 
sentido. The boss fed him completely full. Holy moly. Well. I freed him. Yes! Something most unfortunate has occurred. Don't you just love these cute cradles, man? I, I think this is an improvement. I don't know about you, man. <laughs> Recommend it. Many, many, many. Hey there. Hi. I saw Kevin and Kenji's companion. You I wish I could forget. I like to think he was dancing in the dancing. Yes, there's a part of me that knows. I was not dancing. Please, Stonehead. Hey, please find out why they come back what they need. What a way to make them be gone. Learn their language if you must find out what's happening. <laughs> I can't bear to set him any longer. Ah, I don't even know what to say. Can I chop him down just to end his misery? I wonder. Nope. You get glimpses of these frogs in tent. A sight. A sight. Huh? So. I bet I have to use the thing. Amphibians are driven only by their primal instincts. After feeling the thrill, the frog's nest immediate priority becomes the mate. They intend to mate in a group setting, usually near a quiet water source. Oh, that's unfortunate. That is very unfortunate. <laughs> I knew Kevin wasn't dancing. I <laughs> said like that. This is my fate, so I might just build my bullshit to clean this can as I own. But just as I said, I have to change my ways and better myself. I believe we can't even get some frog mating ground. Here I am rooting to the front row seat. The old Gilbert would have found great pleasure in any other street forces that behold a polyway procreation palooza for the rest of their existence. So it shall be, Stonehead. Accept this fate. You tried your best to help me. Here, take this enchantment. It's not fake. That was only a joke. I see now that making such a joke may have led me here to the situation. I'll take it. Come enchant one. I feel retribution for his past. <laughs> some of the frogs you get to climb Gilbert. Livening by the... Livened by the vibrations, their voices create against this trunk. Oof. Well. So what's this enchantment? Plus one. Damage 10% chance to critical 2.6 critical multiplier. That's way more damage than I could ever wish for. Well, sad for him. Uh, 
I'm gonna upgrade the bow even more. Simply because I can. And also... No result? Holy crap. I thought I'd make at least some dent in it. Well, that's in for the uh, first quest. First legend quest, anyway. Hope you all enjoy, and I'll see you all next time. Ah, that was funny as all hell. Ah.